released July 19th, I mean July 9th, 2016. I continue to document uh, the illegal aliens mafia, its members, and the companies uh, controlled by it. And this is one of the companies, um, T-Mobile. Uh, this company is in charge, as many of the companies uh, that work for the illegal mafia. This company is in charge of interrupting the services uh, for any illegal aliens mafia members victims uh, and um, the, uh, on communicating them uh, upon the request of the illegal mafia. That's just what I have to say about what's going on with this illegal aliens mafia victim elderly and chronically ill citizen Luisa Oyarzun and her caretaker, Solange Martinez, which is me. The uncarrier sales line. Para continuar en español, marque asterisco o diga español. Please say one of the following. New service, order status, find a T-Mobile store, mobile internet, or if you have a T-Mobile number, say my account. Okay, new service. If you'd like to transfer an existing phone number to T-Mobile, say transfer my number. Thank you for calling T-Mobile. My name is Kenny in Albuquerque, and I'm going to be your tech guru here today. Really quick here before we start off, mind if I get a good 10-digit phone number in case I need to call you back for any reason? Yes, 347-721-7242. Got it here. And is that the same number that we're working with today? Uh, no. Uh, 914-619-8362. Perfect. Cool. I just want to make sure that I heard you right. And mind if I get your first and last name real quick? Solange, Esa Sin Sam, Ola Sin Orlando, Ella Sin Love, A as in Apple. G as in George, E as in Edward, Martinez. Gotcha. And do you have the do you have the pin code on the account? Yes. Uh, this is what has been happening. Um, about two weeks uh, after I uh, got the services, the services uh, uh, started very well. It was excellent the first two weeks. Then uh, some people that I reported for trafficking of citizens' identities and government benefits um, found out that I had T-Mobile for uh, my cell phone company. And after that, my uh, T-Mobile cell, um, uh, cell phone services um, stopped. Um, my phone started to have problems with uh, the voice. When you call me, you can hear me, but I cannot hear you. Or um, I can hear you, but you cannot hear me. The um, calls go straight to my voicemail. Um, the uh, um, GPS doesn't work on the phone. Uh, the uh, signals uh, get blocked. Um, they show the bar. Uh, the next uh, minute they don't. And a lot of weird stuff has happened. Uh, so I contacted T-Mobile, and I spoke to about uh, five different representatives who promised that they were going to call me back. They gave me a ticket number, uh, and I have about five uh, different ticket numbers, but they never called me back except for two females uh, that called me back. But nevertheless, uh, never fixed the problem. Uh, and the uh, first uh, three or four representatives who gave me ticket numbers never called me back, called me back because I found out later that there was nothing wrong with my phone, that somebody was doing something, tampering with my line uh, at T-Mobile. So that's why they never called me back, because they said, why should I call her back if she has, there's nothing wrong with her phone, but something is do, uh, something's being do, done from here. So uh, today is the uh, ninth of the month, um, and I received a text message from T-Mobile asking me to pay uh, my monthly fee, and I don't think I should pay the monthly fee for services that I did not receive. So I'm calling to get a credit. Gotcha. I'm going to get a credit and to speak to a supervisor, possibly, so I can uh, okay. ask ask you guys to please connect the line because my mother is dying of cancer, and I need to con connect with the doctors and the uh, people that uh, are assisting her. 
Gotcha. Well, I can definitely make sure we get you the right team for that because at this point, if it is, if considering it's going outside of a technical issue and this is a pain advance account, I'm actually a postpaid. Um, I'd actually have to get you directly over to our pain advance team. So if you don't mind it, I'll just place you on a brief hold and get you directly over to them to see about getting getting credited. Okay. Okay. And your name was Kenny or Kenneth? I'm sorry, I didn't hear. My name you. is Kenny. Oh, Kenny. K E N N Y. Okay, Kenny, thank you much. Hey, no worries. I'm just going to get you right over to him, okay? Okay. Thank you. That's a cool kid. This call may be recorded for quality and training purposes. Thank you for calling T-Mobile. This is Mary. How can I help you today? <clears throat> Hi, Mary. This is Professor Solange Martinez. I'm calling because I have been uh, dealing with um, service interruptions uh, from T-Mobile for about two months or so, two or three months or so, and I was promised by T-Mobile's representatives that they were going to fix the issue. They gave me ticket numbers, different ticket numbers, but they never fixed the issue. So today or yesterday, I believe, I received... Um, a text message asking me to pay money for services that I'm not receiving. So I'm calling T-Mobile to get uh, a credit until the uh, services are restored and I get the services that I'm paying for. Let me go ahead and check on that here for you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm sorry, ma'am, for credit, um, for the services you have not been able to use on your um, on your um, service. I'm sorry, ma'am, you actually need technical support. We actually don't um, apply credit to this office, so I'll connect you with the customer care department, okay? Okay, that's okay. Um, I have been uh, transferred uh, to about uh, half a dozen uh, different people uh, to get the credit that never gets to me, and also uh, I have asked to speak to a supervisor uh, about a dozen times but uh, the supervisor never comes to me. Oh, no. Well, my sister, I got that there. But don't worry. Here's what I'll do. I'll call customer care for you, and um, I'll definitely ask them to connect you over to one of their supervisors, okay? Okay. So, um, please stay on the line. Mm-hmm. Be putting in hold for now, okay? I'll just get a representative for you from our customer care department. Okay. All right. Please stay on the line. 